What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Luna Figs, kicking things off from the Nerd Den. Today, got a little bit of a mixed bag for you. So, uh, prepare for launch. <laughs> I am in Target and the Holothon Fairy has appeared. <laughs> We've got Baxter Stockman, we got Samurai Mikey and Space Adventure Donatello. Got the robot Bebop in Rock City. Business suit Casey with a split foot soldier. A shredder. Got the ultimate Donatello. Mikey. Leo and Raph, so we've got all four turtles. Got the big four pack of the punk disguise. Got the samurai Usagi. That's neat. Got the last road in Sinja Patrol. Very cool looking figures. Then we got Kirby, Elite Guard, Foot Ninja. Two Assassin's Creed figures, the Bebop and Rock City re-release. Got the Silver Falcon Broadway. So it looks like Holothon has finally hit at this target. Let's see what else they got. Lots of gargles, Toonie Terrors. Some pops. There's Metal Sonic, Carl Malone and John Stockton, that's a throwback. <laughs> Got Spider-Man, that's really cool. Ghost Rider, <laughs> Stranger Things, little people. Let's see, do we have, we got Fei Long and Chun Li. I've already got Chen Li and I don't want Fei Long. But they don't have the two that I'm after still. Still looking for M. Bison and Dossim. Got some Bat Cycles animated series Batman figures Joker, Scarecrow. There's Batman. There's Ted Lasso up there. And some more pops and randomness. Got some Doom figures on clearance down here. $27.99. All right. I think that's going to do it for back here. All right. We're checking out action figures now. And that's kind of the story right there. <laughs> they have a little bit more than that, but not much. We got Iron Man, Button Junkyard. Got Metalhead up here, Magneto, X-Men 97. That's where it's at right now. <laughs> Great show. Uh, got some Fright Features, Ghostbusters. That's just Peter. Got Alfred down here. And just a handful of Transformers. All right, let's keep going. Over in the Lego now. Looks like there's a leftover sticker because that sale was over last week. <laughs> uh, Lego Technic Space. Still a cool set. Uh, my wife is still working on putting that one together. Taking her sweet time on it. <laughs> uh, got some Forza. Remote control cars. Here's the rest of the Lego. Got Star Wars. Cool. Little display for the invisible hand. The helmets. A little bit of Harry Potter. Sonic. A little space mech. That's pretty neat. I think she would like this. It's a Marvel. And Friends and Disney. 
Dreams. Yeah, that's Lego. Over in Diecast style, checking out the Hot Wheels. Got some pretty neat looking stuff over here. Always love the little toony cars. And we got the Gauntlet. That is very cool looking. Don't have that one yet. I do have the Ghost. And Boba Fett ship. Got that one already too. Got Batman Racer Verse. And Black Panther. Captain Marvel. Mario Kart. Diamond Dash. It's like a little food truck, burgers and fries. Some monster jams. Ford Ranchero. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right, that is it for Diecast. Check it out, wrestling, got Hulk Hogan, Matt Riddle, Ultimate Warrior, 30% off. That's a deal. Another Ultimate Warrior. Got the Undertaker. Brody King. Pinta Oscuro. Rey Mysterio. Get on there. John Cena. Who's this one? Who's gold? I see a Cassidy. Why is he in a gold box? I don't know. <laughs> oh, got Cody Rhodes down here. A couple of those. Andre the Giant. We got one new Black Series figure. The Tuscan Chieftain. First time seeing any of the new wave here at Target. Still got Bo Katan hanging out. Wonder if she's back up to full price or if she's still on clearance. Uh, we got Sun Man 3 packs on sale. Got some Turtles of Grey Skull, Man at Arms, and He Man. There's Mouse Jaw up there. Got some Mutating Bebop, Raph, Donnie. There's Rock Steady. So that's pretty neat. And some dinosaurs. All right, I think that does it. All right, I'm in another Target now. Probably not gonna film too much in here because they don't have much different going on. But they do have Slacker, Slaker, whatever you want to call this guy. He's pretty darn cool looking from Turtles of Grey Skull. It's the first time seeing it. Didn't know these were supposed to be out yet. Thought they were street dated. But anyways, it's here. So uh, that's pretty cool. I'll uh, take a look around. If I see anything else, I'll let you know. Otherwise, that might be all you see from this Target. All right, I lied. I'm going to give you a little bit more at this Target. Got Hera. Got the Gungan Bongo submarine. Some Hot Wheels Starship Selects. We've got a few... Transformers, got Scrap Heap, Starscream, we got Happy Superman, <laughs> they finally made a Happy Superman, and Animal Man, 30% off, clearance, oh, they're still right there, and the Unmasked Dark Knight Batman, looks like the Python Patrol Copperhead, 30% off, so is the Baroness. Uh, we got quite a few mutt and junkyards. <laughs> it's a great set though. Then we got the Iron Spider up here. And we got Cap and he's on sale, 30% off. 
And we got Last Stand Spidey and Spider Shot. But that looks like that's it for the action figure section. Just found a clearance end cap. Got a bunch of light year stuff. I don't know where all this has been hiding. <laughs> but if you want to ship, they got you covered. Look, we got a bunch of Wolverine pops also on clearance. And we got this Luke down to 839. Can't decide if I need this or not. Yeah, I guess you'll have to stay tuned and see if I pick it up. Now I'm over in Walmart. Not a whole lot going on, but I did find some new superpowers. Got Blue Beetle. What is this like a Korean Batman? I don't know what this is. It's got a weird logo there. The colors are kind of different. Ears look weird too on them. And we got Kilowog. That's pretty neat. And got Brainiac. I wonder if these bring up that's four dollars. <laughs> that would be kind of neat. I'm not doing superpowers anymore though, so I will scan them and report back there. All right, that does it for this toy hunt. Two targets and a Walmart, technically. <laughs> Just that one clip from Walmart. But uh, let's start off with Target. Saw Holothon. And Holothon brought it hard at that Target. Finally, everything was showing up on the shelves. Had all four of the Ultimate Turtles. Had the four pack of the Street Turtles. Usagi Yojimbo. Had the Samurai Mikey and Astronaut Donnie. Very cool. And I didn't pick it up. And I know, I said that was the one I was after. But after seeing it in person, I decided, nah, I'm just not interested in it. <laughs> so I don't think I'm going to pick up anything for Holothon this year. Uh, also saw that uh, Broadway from Gargoyles. Again, a cool looking figure. They were all great looking figures. Just nothing's really interesting me. So that's the way it goes. But that's okay. That, that saves my wallet. <laughs> we uh, looked around some more. Saw a few things over in Diecast. Saw some cool Star Wars ships. Uh, then we went over to Action Figures. Not a lot going on over there. <laughs> saw a lot of empty pegs at first. Did see a few random Joes. Uh, some Ghostbusters. I think two new Transformers. <laughs> but that's about it. So we hop over to the other target and their holothon had pretty much gotten wiped out. I'd seen quite a bit there the week before, but I think everybody else found them too. <laughs> so not much going on back there. Did see a uh, slacker, slaker, however you pronounce that. I don't know. I don't think anybody has an official pronunciation for that just yet, but pretty cool. Nice looking figure. I think it's Probably one of the cooler looking figures of the line so far. And that was the first time I'd seen it. I think I'd heard that it was street dated or something. But maybe uh, that was the street date for that day. I don't know. I didn't try to purchase it or anything. Uh, I've got a feeling that's going to hang out like Trap Jaw. So I'm just going to wait. If I pick it up at all, I'm going to get it at a discount. That's how I'm handling Turtles of Grey Skull. If I can find a deal on one, I'll pick it up. Otherwise... No. <laughs> uh, then we looked around a little bit more, saw some clearance items, saw that Luke, and I decided to pass on it as well for one reason. I don't like the little soft goods thing that they did uh, down at the bottom of his tunic or whatever. It just doesn't jive with me. The fabric that they use just doesn't go with the rest of the figure. I don't really think it was necessary, to be honest. Uh, even at eight dollars just didn't want that deluxe luke so empty-handed on this toy hunt saw a lot of stuff <laughs> oh, oh almost forgot it was so quick <laughs> went to walmart did see some new superpowers that uh now help me out i don't know if that was korean or chinese or japanese i'm, I'm sorry <laughs> i just didn't recognize that particular style of writing but it was a neat looking Batman. <laughs> and the colors were kind of interesting. That 
kind of muted gray and everything. Neat. <laughs> Just not my cup of tea again. Then we saw Brainiac, Kilowog, and Blue Beetle. So those were some new superpowers showing up at Walmart. I've been seeing some new stuff at GameStop, but Walmart has been like nothing showing up there as far as superpowers goes for quite a while. So I guess the clearance that they're doing on the older figures is making room for some new stuff, which is always good. But anyways, like I said, empty handed, that's okay. That's uh, all I've got for today. If you are new here, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, turn on your notifications. I'll see you guys next time around.